Hi everyone, this is Brian Hayes and welcome to a tutorial where we focus on playing the blues scale against a minor blues. Now in the description for this tutorial, I've got a link to my original lesson where I went through the notes of the most common blues scale as applied to the most common chords in the blues. In the key of C, those three common chords in a 12-bar blues would be C7, F7, G7, and C7. And of course in the order of a traditional blues order. Today we're going to change to a minor blues. Now the chords in a C minor bass blues would actually be C minor, F minor, and we'll stick with G7 as the third chord, and back to the minor. So very different sounding chords. But the exciting thing is the same notes from the C blues scale, C, E flat, F, G flat, G, B flat, and C, sound just as good against the minor blues as against the traditional dominant seventh chord blues. I'll switch across to my electric guitar and put the camera zoomed right into my left hand so you can see the notes I'm fretting. I won't go over the notes in the relevant blues scale here again today, but I've got a link in the description to this tutorial to my former tutorial on how to play the blues scale on the guitar. And I take a lot of time in that tutorial to go through the names of the notes in the different positions when we switch to the blues scales starting on, in this case, C, F or G. Now, the first time through this 12 bar blues, I'm just going to play the C blues scale. I'm going to let the band change from C minor to F minor to G seventh, and I'm just going to run up and down the one scale, a C blues scale. On the second repeat through the 12 bar blues, I'm going to change as the chords change. And I'll put a music score up on the screen so you can see the notes I'm playing and the chords that I'm applying them against. It's an incredibly powerful scale one of the very few scales that is equally powerful against major keys and minor keys. I hope you enjoy this. Bye for now. 